Hi again, this is Shuman from Skywatching Workshop. Today, I will introduce with a new telescope, Explorer Scientific 130 telescope. That means it's a 5 inch telescope. Mostly we use a 130Q that is with the equilateral mount of Celestron. So sometimes we face uh, some equilateral mount issues like those who are uh, using the telescope as a basic one. Uh, suppose somebody is very new to this uh, using a telescope. For them the equilateral mount is very 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 hard. Because uh, Whenever they install the telescope, that is one C Q, the equilateral mount, sometimes we uh, receive so many calls from them that the equilateral mount is not balancing properly, uh, it is not working properly equilaterally because there are some uh, practice needed to use the equilateral mount. Those who are using the telescope's first time. For they the AZ azimuth mount telescope is much more easier, much much more easier than the equilateral mount telescope. So today I uh, am going to introduce this 130mm telescope, not the equilateral mount, it's an AZ azimuth mount. Very easily, suppose somebody is traveling with this to any place for the stargazing, instead of using an equilateral mount, they can use this AZ mount 130 mm telescope of Explorer Scientific. It's a fantastic telescope, fantastic telescope. And really, I found I'm fond of this telescope because when I travel with this telescope I actually require a very little time very very little time to mount this telescope because only one screw two screw and three screw I will show you that is enough to mount the telescope start using it. So whenever we are traveling to some equipment or stargazing, we always look up to that kind of device which provides us a maximum utility with a laser time to mount the So my opinion is without using the equilateral telescope for the basic purpose, I will suggest everyone to go with this azimuth mount telescope. So, friends, I will show you how to assemble this telescope as quick as possible, and what are the accessories provided with this telescope into the box all the details and I will show you how easily how in a lesser time you can mount this telescope and start so be with us I will show you how the assembly works hi right. now what comes inside the box this is
this is the easy is it as on mount very easy to operate this will look like this way so that you can move the telescope like this way and this will orient you like this way. so in this mount you will get the horizontal and vertical movement so that the telescope can stay at 90 degrees this is the accessory string Fantastic radar finder scope provided into this box. This is the mat to fit the AZ mount. Super fossil 25 mm eyepiece. Super fossil eyepiece 25 mm. KMM fully coated eye pills comes with this box and a Barlow 3x Barlow X. It's a 3x Barlow X. And the main part is this. This is the
right here, my wife is over here. Just open the screw. Put the right here, my wife is into it. And it is ready to finish. So it's so easy to assemble the telescope within a few minutes and start observing the night sky. And if we go with the equilateral mount, it takes a lot of time to assemble the telescope and to handle it. See, I'm moving it horizontally and vertically. See, I will just lose this key and Just 90 degree. So when the stars, planets, and moons are at the top of the sky, you can observe it. So thank you, friends. This is for today. We'll come again with another new device, another new telescope, and I will show you. What are the easiest way and the what are the easiest way and the what are the very easy installing